<laughs> so, sorry, I'm just laughing because EA Sports sent me and not Jules here to Hong Kong. <laughs> oh God, <laughs> poor Jules. And they sent me here to have a chat with a guy named Matt Bilby, who's one of the head honchos behind FIFA 14. Now, I love the FIFA games and Rather than prepare a standard interview and do research and diligently organize the line of questioning, what I decided to do this morning was put out a tweet to you guys and say, what would you like to know? What would you expect from the new FIFA game? I'm holding a mobile phone to represent that that's where I access those tweets. Now you sent through a lot of ridiculous questions and a lot of ridiculous comments, so I decided to use them and waste the time of this very important man. Here's what happened. Someone's requested a feature called Barisha's Barber where you can design the player's haircuts. Uh, that's... One day we could put that in there. We have customizable. We have the ability to customise your player and their haircut right now. So in actual fact, you can do that already. The goal celebration should become even more and more elaborate. For example, you should be able to take a chunk out of Ivanovic's arm if you want. We'd have to change the name of our game and break the rules of uh, the governing body of football to do things like that. We've had a suggestion for odds before each game to be delivered by a girl in Australia named Jamie Rogers from TAB Sports Bet. Never heard of her. Should I have? <laughs> YouTuber later. <laughs> a suggestion to have the opportunity to create the great goals of history. For example, Robbie Cornthwaite's goal from five centimetres out against Korea. I think the, the ability to actually take famous moments in football uh, and actually be able to replay them in our game and that's a good idea and we'll probably end up doing that at some point in the future. Would you have a personal favourite Cornthwaite memory or moment that you'd like to re recreate? Cornthwaite? No, I don't. Someone says you should be able to select your own Ginger World Eleven. <laughs> you can in Ultimate Team. More opportunities for people to choose uh, niche, niche countries like Tahiti. I think... Tahiti. When you score a goal that goes in the top corner, would it be possible for the commentator to always say, he puts it where the spiders live? <laughs> Never gonna happen. If you're through one-on-one -on -one with a keeper, pretty easy opportunity, and you miss a shot on goal, uh, one of our Twitter followers has requested that you hear Mark Bosnich's laugh. But what is Mark Bosnich's laugh out of interest? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you're looking good, mate, you're looking good. We'll see what we can do. <laughs> Someone's requested a power-up mode for top or Stanley clearances, where clearances are that strong that if he clears it in FIFA 14, you don't retrieve the ball until FIFA 15. That's a bad idea. <laughs> next. Finally, a uh, suggestion of a name change for next year. Instead of uh, FIFA 15, you know, let's break the mould a little bit. How do you feel about Cornthwaite 15? Cornthwaite 15? I've got to meet this guy, Cornthwaite. Um, yeah, it's not going to happen.